Hi, my name is James Young. I am 52 years old and I'm looking for a position to teach English overseas. I just recently received TESOL certification uh, from the American TESOL Institute. Uh, I became interested in teaching English when uh, I was in China back in 2001. I was taking Mandarin Chinese lessons and I was working with my teacher to improve her English skills quite a bit uh, at the time and I enjoyed it uh, a lot. Um, and I thought about uh, changing my careers back then but I uh, decided to wait a few years and um, now I think I'm, I'm ready to make the switch. Um, so I received certification and I'm uh, eager to get started. Um, I've got 13 years with Nortel. Uh, it's a communications company. They build networks for companies like Sprint, uh, Verizon, Vodafone, or AT&T. And um, I started out with them when I was 19 years old, back in uh, 1995. Um, installing, I was an installer when I first started, uh, physically installing the hardware of these networks, and I traveled across the country and two other countries as well at the time. I moved up into uh, software engineering where I would build uh, the software that would allow all the communications, uh, the components to talk to each other. And uh, from there I went into management uh, and managed uh, 10 to 20 people at a time. Um, and I was there for a year or two and then I went into network engineering as a uh, technical advisor. Uh, and there it was a mix of management and uh, as well as creating processes for um, communication and uh, quality uh, checks and such. Uh, and I've had quite a bit of experience with leading people, with uh, training them to get uh, for them to learn their jobs. I've had quite a bit of experience with working with people internationally, um, all over the world, um, uh, in China, uh, in Mexico, in Australia, and uh, the list goes on and on. But, um, and um, I, so I come with a lot of qualifications that um, enable me to be patient because I'm constantly teaching people things that they have no understanding of and having to be go over it multiple times and such. Now teaching English is going to be a different, um, a completely different um, skill set. However, I do feel that the skills that I have, uh, I've learned over the past 13 years will help me uh, to be able to teach them uh, English. As well as the fact that I'm very passionate about this. I really enjoy uh, spending time with people who want to learn English and who want to learn in general and just teaching them whatever I know. So I hope this is um, uh, something that's very positive, uh, not just for me but for the, uh, uh, the students as well um, to come together really as a team and not necessarily as um, something that I just give them information and either they, they get it or they don't. I want it to be more of a team effort and that the goal at the end of the, whether it's a, a, a semester or if it's a year, uh, at the end of the day, um, it's a, the only way they can, I can be a success is if they are a success. So, so all right. Uh, thank you very much.